How to knit the tight braid cable stitch, English style. For this tutorial, you will need a pair of knitting needles. Special thanks to our sponsor, Skissel, for providing today's needles. Today, we are using their Addy Lace Interchangeable Clicks in the size 8. Special thanks to our sponsor, Lion Brand, for providing today's yarn who are introducing their Bon Bon line, a collection of mini skeins of yarn that are perfect for your everyday craft needs and different types of color work. Today we are using their Celebrate colorway. For this stitch you'll need to know the following techniques. Knit, purl, cable four front, cable four back. This cable stitch is worked over 10 stitches on a reverse stockinette background. Even though this cable is worked on a reverse stockinette background, we're not going to include the instructions for those uh, stitches. We're just going to include the instructions for the center part of the stitch. Row 1. Beginning on the wrong side of our work, we're going to purl all stitches. Row 2. We're going to begin by knitting two. Then we're going to take our cable needle or double pointed needle and we're going to do a cable four forward. So we're going to slip the next two stitches off of our main needle with our cable needle and we'll hold that in front of our work. Then we'll knit the next two stitches off of our main needle. Then we're going to knit the two stitches off of our cable needle. Okay, now we're going to repeat that again. So we're going to do another cable for front. We'll slip the two stitches off onto our cable needle and hold that in front. Then we're going to knit two from our main needle and then knit two from our cable needle. Okay, now we'll finish the row. Row three, we're going to purl all stitches. Row four, we're going to begin by doing a cable four back. So we're gonna slip the next two stitches off of our main needle onto our cable needle, and we'll hold that behind our work. Then we're going to knit the next two stitches off of our main needle. And then we'll knit the two stitches off of our cable needle. Okay, now we're actually going to repeat the cable four back. So we'll slip two stitches again off of our main needle onto our cable needle and hold that behind our work. Then we'll knit two from our main needle and then two from our cable needle. And we're going to finish up our row by knitting two. So we're going to repeat rows one through four until you've reached your desired length. And that's how you knit the tight braid cable stitch. After a few repeats, your pattern should look like this. Want more New Stitch Day? Check out our website at newstitchaday.com.